Dortmund hold crisis talk with manager Marco Rose after Rangers loss. Borussia Dortmund manager Marco Rose and the team's hierarchy have reportedly held a crisis meeting following an embarrassing 4-2 at home against Rangers on Thursday night. The Bundesliga were dismantled by the Scottish champions in the first leg of their Europa League playoff, a defeat which only intensified the scrutiny Rose already found himself under. According to Sky Germany, shortly after the game Rose was summoned to a meeting with Dortmund chief executive Hans-Joachim Watzke, Michael Zork and Sebastian Kell, respectively the current and incumbent sporting director. The report indicated that while Dortmund's hierarchy met with Rose, his position isn't understood to be in danger for the time being. The scenario, however, could change should the black and yellows fail to qualify for the Champions League this season. They are currently second in the Bundesliga, six points behind league leaders Bayern. The defeat against Rangers was Dortmund's second consecutive loss at home in all competitions, coming just 11 days after a disastrous 5-2 reversal against Bayern Leverkusen at the Westfalen Stadion. News of the meeting came after veteran defender Mats Hummels delivered a scathing assessment of the team's tactical approach, describing it as nonsensical and not suited to deliver results. If you look at the Leverkusen game a 5-2 loss for Dortmund, we conceded four goals after unnecessarily losing the ball, he told German broadcaster RTL. That happened with the first, second and fourth goals here. I think we know what our problem is. The coach mentions it often enough. Hummels, who won a combined 14 major trophies with Dortmund and Bayern Munich, added, We're playing an awful lot of nonsensical football, a lot of illogical football and making our opponents so strong. Our football is also too complicated. We play a lot of nonsensical football, so you can sometimes win and sometimes lose. But you'll never be successful like that. Rose's men had the better of the opening exchanges on Thursday night, before falling apart in spectacular fashion. James Tavernier converted a penalty late in the first half to give Rangers the lead, before Alfredo Morelos added a second just two minutes later. John Lundstrom added a third shortly after the break and Dan Axel's Agadou deflected the ball 